really trying to get two players around him at all time and try and nullify his, his ability to get the ball and have time and space. Chapman dealing with both Alaski brothers there. Possession for the switchbacks. Nice comeback by Chapman. Plays it off. Scundrick's the ball into the box. Dealt with the first try, but not fully gone. Opportunity for Chapman to take this one. In the swinging corner, into the box. Header was put towards goal, but it goes over the top. Yeah, and I, I didn't see it as the big talking points is what the formation would be. Of course, like Kevin. Playing around the corner, some success to be had. It's a lot of credit to Stephen Hogan and this visiting side. Quick turnover, it's DeShane Beckford. Beckford off the post. No cause to perspire. Brought down by Chapman. Tahara. This season, his mental side is growing. There's a cross towards the spot. It's the hero against Orange County last time out. As a substitute, he gets the start tonight. And Jay Chapman lines one up. He's going to let it fly, and Vitiano palms it out for a corner on the far side. Good build up play to get that shot off. Decent shot on target. New details, clinching a playoff spot, if not clinch a playoff spot tonight, ending results elsewhere. Yes, cutting in fields. Yelberg, trying to make one more pass, in the end he was thwarted. But it falls for Jairo Enriquez again, and he scores! Still pretty dangerous here, looking like they're about to put it just right into the mix. They do indeed, that's free in front, comes out to Abu! Tough decision there for Corgan, he goes yellow. Free kick here. Oh, what a goal! Colorado Springs down two men have the lead. It's Jay Chapman with the kiss off the crossbar. Colorado Springs switchbacks FC are in front in Seaside. It's underneath the crossbar, watches Chapman, an in-swinger over top of the bar, nothing Herrera could do as he steps off his line a little too far. Watches Herrera, he makes that jump.